You're watching the news on Bahrain International. I'm Mohammed Shaban. Good evening. The commander of the National Guard, General His Honor Sheikh Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa, attended a ceremony organized by the Pakistan Army marking Pakistan's National Day, which falls on March the 23rd. The ceremony was attended by Pakistani President Dr. Araf Alawi, senior military leaders, and dignitaries from a number of countries. His Honor Sheikh Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa extended his warmest greetings and congratulations to the Pakistani President and to the people, expressing his admiration for the military parades made by the Pakistani Army and characterized by high efficiency, readiness, and skill of the troops. He also praised the close relations between the Kingdom of Bahrain and the Islamic Republic of Pakistan and the role of the Republic of Pakistan in supporting regional security and stability, pointing out the advanced level of cooperation and military exchange between the two sides. The parachute jump team also made an air show.
In the presence of the deputy chairman of the Russia Equestrian and Horse Racing Club High Committee, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and Sheikh Salman bin Abdullah bin Hamad Al Khalifa, the Russia Equestrian and Horse Racing Club held the 21st race meeting of the season at the race course at Sakhir. It was held for the cups of His Highness Sheikh Abdullah bin Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Khalifa bin Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Sultan bin Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, and Asri. Also present at the race were Sheikh Sultan Din bin Hamad bin Salman Al Khalifa, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid bin Isa Al Khalifa, Sheikh Salman bin Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa, Sheikh Nuh bin Mohammed bin Salman Al Khalifa, as well as horse racing fans. The event comprised eight races. At the end of the race, trophies were presented to the winners.
President of the Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities, Sheikh Hamid bin Mohammed Al Khalifa, went on to participate in the official launch of the Tunis as capital of the Islamic culture in 2019 from the Arab region, which was held under the patronage of Tunisian President B.G. Said de Sibsi. On this occasion, Sheikh Hamid expressed her pride in participating in this important event and said that after working for a full year in which Muharraq was the capital of Islamic culture, we come today to participate in an Arab city known for its cultural and civilizational features. Tunisia as a capital of Islamic culture is recognition of the great human heritage. She said that the culture is still the best way to promote the image of our real countries and to strengthen our cultural position among states. She stressed the need to take care of the cultural heritage and adopt strategies for joint action and cooperation among all parties in order to raise the Arab and Islamic societies and involve them in the process of sustainable development because the Arab and Islamic countries are able to lead the general cultural scene and is eligible to attract visitors from around the world.